as a replacement. With the top assembly removed, carefully unplug the laser ribbon cable and pry off the top of the laser unit, careful not to pull on the power wire and second ribbon cable. You can then flip the unit over to gain access to the laser assembly. To remove the laser, unscrew the three screws that connect to the metal rods. You will then be able to lift and remove the laser. To reinstall the laser, first insert the notched end of the laser over the installed metal rod and then insert the other end with the removed rod back into place. Be sure to replace all the removed screws. Then flip the laser assembly back over, being sure to thread the wire and ribbon cables back into its notch. Flip the assembly back over, and making sure that the four posts line up to their corresponding holes, snap back into place. Then make sure to reattach the bottom ribbon cable. And reattach the bottom metal plate. 